Hey guys, found this cute little vanity on OfferUp. So stoked about it. Thought this would be a great time to share with you our DIY foolproof chalk paint recipe that sells, that gives that farmhouse look every time. Stick around, check out our recipe, and paint some cool stuff. Hey guys, welcome to Repurpose Adventures. Today we are talking DIY chalk paint. If you wanna achieve that antique finish or that farmhouse look that's always on trend, then DIY chalk paint is the way to go. Now there are a lot of chalk paint recipes out there and they're upwards of $40 a pint. <laughs> yeah, seriously. If I wanna make money on my finished product then I have to make my own chalk paint. It's just too expensive other ways. Other ways otherwise it's too expensive period i like to save money out of all of the diy chalk paint recipes out there the one i'm going to show you today has been my favorite for years and it always gives me that foolproof finish that sells and i mean that's what we want right <laughs> okay guys here is the breakdown for my foolproof diy chalk paint recipe and you're gonna love it trust me um, there are a lot of uh, chalk paint recipes out there that say don't use plaster of Paris, but I'm going to tell you, use it, but don't use it by itself. Use it in conjunction with the calcium carbonate. You guys, it, it has a, a great uh, combination together and it's going to allow your paint to be super distressable and give it that uh, farmhouse look at the end that you really are going to want. There's not a lot of ingredients. It's super easy. So what we like to do with our family business is make um, a double batch. So I'll go through that at the end, but we use two tablespoons of the plaster of Paris. We'll use two tablespoons of the calcium carbonate and roughly two tablespoons of water. And then we use two cups of the paint and we mix it um, in this way. We do two tablespoons of the plaster of Paris and it's a little bit of a heap. That's how we'd like to do that, a little bit of a heap. So that's two. And we use uh, two tablespoons of the calcium carbonate. Give it a little bit of a heap. Okay, just like that. And then we mix in about two tablespoons of water, a little bit more. I find that if it's just a little bit more runny, it allows for um, no clumps. And then with that, a little more of water and then just something to stir it with and it, it literally it looks it looks a little milky which is what we want get all those clumps out and it dissolves really nicely it gets out and as you can see it's nice and it's got a little bit of fluidity to it which makes it perfect I think so okay now we're gonna add the two cups of paint And stir. And this really, as you can see, it gives it that really milky look to it. Now I use the flat latex paint. I get it from Walmart because I like to save money. Um, quick cover Glidden flat interior white paint latex. Um, Plaster of Paris, get it on Amazon under five bucks. And we go through so much of this that we get the get it in bulk, uh, calcium carbonate. This is around $30, but it's totally cost effective to do it that way. And we make a lot of paint. And so I think that you will like this. You can find calcium carbonate cheaper in a smaller container. But like I said, we go through a lot. The white distressed farmhouse look is what sells around here. So we just stick with that color. Our DIY foolproof chalk paint recipe that sells, that we're happy with, that gives us that um, Hey guys, found this cute little vanity on offer up and I thought what a great time to share with you our full poof 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 yeah that too
Okay, I'm gonna give you down. Okay, here's the breakdown. And it's a great time to share with you our DIY chalk paint recipe that's foolproof. Furniture sells. It's awesome. You're gonna love it. I like you. You're pretty rad. Let's take another take. Yeah. Thank you.